Hi, my name is Alderin Ordell, and I'm the owner of WaterForLifeUSA.com. We are the exclusive distributors for EOS water ionizers, so if you want to take a look at our selection, please visit us at www.WaterForLifeUSA.com. This is an experiment that you can do with your EOS water ionizer. Today we're using the EOS DNA water ionizer. And the first step is to turn on your water ionizer and set it to the highest alkaline setting. Go ahead and turn on your water. Send it over to your water ionizer. Press the on button. And this is the 11 pH water, so I'm going to go ahead and show you first. You can see all the bubbles bubbling around in there. That is the antioxidants in the water, the hydroxyl ions. You can see it better that way. The hydroxyl ions will go into your cells and uh, neutralize free radicals and lower what's called oxidative stress levels in your cells so it's very very good for you and you can see that this is indeed a very strong alkaline pH at 11 pH so next we're going to take our green tea bags and we're going to put one green tea bag into tap water and then the other green tea bag into the high alkaline water and I will show you the power of those hydroxyl ions. Okay, so first I'm going to take my glass and I'm going to go ahead and fill it up with the regular tap water. This is just cold tap water coming from Portland, Oregon. It's about a 7 pH coming out of the tap. I'm going to take my bag of green tea Actually, I'm going to do them both at the same time so you can see them working side by side. But there's our tap water. Next, I'm going to make my high alkaline water. The optimal flow rate is about two and a half liters per minute. So you can see I'm a little bit higher right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn that down just a tad. Next, I'm gonna fill up my glass with the high alkaline water. So I go ahead and select my five pH. Turn on the water. Go ahead and collect my high alkaline water. And you can see the cloudiness of this water much better here. You can see the those hydroxyl ions bubbling around in there. So now that we've got... Oh, you can really see them in the light. There we go. See them bubbling around in there? That's the power of ionized water. So let me go ahead and turn off the uh, ionizer so we're not wasting water. Let's go ahead and put a bag into the, new the neutral tap water and then a bag into our ionized water. Go ahead and push them down in there. Get down nice and close so we can see all the action. So you can already see my ionized water is turning quite yellow, meaning it's already making the tea. I'm going to be fair here and really swirl this around and do the same thing over here. And you can notice the difference. Look how much darker the green tea is on the right than it is on the left. 
So what's happening is those hydroxyl ions are going inside that tea bag in the same way they'd go inside your cell in your body and it's pulling out what's inside that tea bag. So the same thing is going to happen when you drink the ionized water. It's going to get inside your cells. It's going to lend all those hydroxyl ions to the unstable oxygen molecules that are called free radicals. It's going to neutralize them, pull them out of the cells and detoxify your body. So you can see just how powerful an antioxidant alkaline ionized water really is.